Let's take a look at a safe light dispatch. First is the dispatch date. This is immediately followed by your shop name and contact information, along with your unique SGC shop ID number. The customer information will be listed here and will include a description of the vehicle along with the part to be repaired or replaced. While SafeLight will often list the NAGS part to be used, other comparable parts may be substituted in some cases. Keep in mind, pre-approvals may be required. If a deductible is owed, it will be listed here and you'll want to collect this amount directly from your customer. Each dispatch will have a specific number called a referral number. This is the number you'll reference when contacting SafeLight with questions regarding the claim. Just below the referral number is the date of loss, which will need to be included on the invoice when submitting it for payment. Next, let's talk about pricing. First, you'll see the glass discount listed. In this example, the insurance company will pay 43% off the NAGS list price for the glass. Keep in mind, these rates will vary depending on the insurance company being billed. The WS and CT abbreviations stand for windshield and tempered, respectively, and are generally billed at the same discount. Labor rates will be listed next and will be paid at an hourly or flat rate. Some dispatches may even list molding or recalibration rates as well. Kits, also called adhesive or glue, will be listed here. These rates are generally broken down by quantity. In this example, kits are paid as follows. Standard kits are one for $15 and two for $30. High modulus kits are one for $20 and two for $40. And fast cure kits are two for $30. Once again, you will see some variation in the kit rates depending on the insurance company being billed. The insurance company will be listed here along with their trading partner program ID. This number will be needed if submitting invoices via EDI. Lastly, every dispatch will also provide useful information on how and when to obtain prior approvals and how to build the job once completed. Hopefully, this gives you a better understanding of SafeLight dispatches. If you have any questions on dispatch pricing or need help submitting your invoices, please reach out to us through a support ticket and glass biller or email us at support at glassbiller.com. Also, please like this video and subscribe to the channel to be notified when future training videos become available.